he didn't think that he did anything wrong. And he didn't even realize what had happened, which is like mind boggling to me. I'm a junior musical theater major. I was at a party that was closed off to a group that I am involved with on campus. And there was one guy that we had to do a lot together within that group. So I got pretty close to him. Um, he was older than me. The guy that I mentioned had offered to walk me home. He didn't really live anywhere near me, but so I thought that that was really nice of him and I didn't think anything weird of it. So he ordered an Uber and we get in the Uber. I figured that like he lived with other people that we were both involved in that program with, but he actually lived by himself. At that point I was like, this is kind of weird. So I started asking like, can you take me back? Like now I don't feel good, blah, blah, blah. And he was like, well, now you can't leave. I was not consciously okay. I was like falling asleep and everything. Um, and then he proceeded to touch me in ways that I did not say yes to. Um, and he asked like, is this okay? And I said, no. And he laughed and didn't stop. Every time I would be in the same room with him or something, I like clearly wouldn't be okay. I would cry a lot. I would like kind of just break down. The one that said like, this is a lie and she was asking for it. I don't know if people agree with her. The biggest thing that I don't understand is how she can do that to another girl so easily. Situations like this, like we are solely here to have each other's backs. So I think that that's a really hard thing for me to grasp in general. The reason I didn't want anybody to ask questions and I didn't really necessarily want to tell anybody was because I was scared that it was my fault. I, I woke up and blamed everything on myself. I don't want it to define me in any way, shape or form because that's not who I am and that's not a good judgment on who I am as a person. A lot of girls my age and in college probably just want to forget that it even happened. And I think that Title IX would make that very hard, which is why I didn't go. I didn't want to press charges or anything. Like, I just wanted it to go away. As angry as it, and upset as it makes me now, I was in a totally different place when it happened. Rep is doing a really good job with trying to erase the stigma of sexual assault. You're getting real feedback on like what's going on and you're getting somebody your own age telling you that it's gonna be okay. Having or, like organizations on campus that are run by students is more important to me than having an organization on campus like Title IX.